All right, I'm going to do a video with you guys, and um, this is absolutely one of the craziest things I've ever done, and I don't know how it's going to turn out, so we're going to do this together. Mary's birthday is today. She turns five, and just like all my children, she's a little bit odd in the fact that she <laughs> <laughs> likes things that are, most children don't. Uh, she is obsessed with... Drum roll. Drum roll, Isaac. Naked mole rats. I just want to tell you that today, this is what we're doing. Making naked mole rat cupcakes. Because she likes them. I don't know why. She's obsessed with them. She thinks they're the coolest critters in the world, so... Anyway, here we go. What I'm going to do is because it's crazy and it's Christmas and I don't have time for anything else, I just went ahead and bought myself one of these easy uh, cake mixes to do the cupcakes. But I'm going to upscale it a little bit and I'm going to add a kiss in the middle so it gives it like a little um, hot lava cake type um, similarity. And then we're going to make a pink icing. My plan is to use these for the teeth use the pink marshmallows for the nose and two mini semi-sweet chocolate chips for the eyes so let's get started all right so i'm just cooking this to uh follow the instructions half a cup of water three large eggs and a half cup vegetable and i'm gonna mix it for two minutes All right, now I'm going to cook these for just like three, uh, three minutes or so. And then I'm going to take them out and put the uh, kisses in them. Okay, so I pulled them out. They've been in there for a little over three minutes. I'm just going to kind of ease these in here. I'm sorry about the background noise, y'all. I don't even know if you can hear me good. The kids are watching um, Willy Wonka and the Chocolate Factory. So the old one, the good one. So, anyhow, got these in here. Now I'm going to pop them back in the oven for around 13 minutes or so until a toothpick is entered, in, in, inserted on the side and comes out clean. Okay, so for the um, icing, I'm going to do a buttercream icing and I just need a couple of tablespoons of uh, whipped cream one cup of butter it does call for unsalted but I don't have unsalted right now so, but I do have salted but it also calls for a little bit of salt so I'm going to eliminate the salt since this already has a little salt in there it needs to be room temperature that's the most important thing about making icing it is room temperature see it's squishy all right and then uh, a pound of powdered sugar and some vanilla and this is some vanilla that I made earlier in the spring so I'm excited to use our homemade vanilla and that's all you need to make the icing now if you google naked mole rat you will see the glory um, the glorious bodies they sport uh, but anyway so they're naked and their skin color is kind of like a beigey pinkish flesh disgusting in my opinion color so that's the color that we made this icing we mixed a little bit of red a little bit of brown a little bit of yellow did you have any blue in there Eva uh -huh. just a tad of blue it took us a while to mix it in a little tiny dish we mixed it all together and then we kind of added it in small batches and we came up with this perfect naked mole rat flesh color so this is our icing that I'm fixing to decorate on the cupcakes all right, I'm sorry the lighting is so bad in here um, where I've got these sitting. It's kind of more of natural light, so it's kind of hard to see the real good color. All right, so I've got the pink marshmallows for the nose, the almond slivers for the teeth, and the um, mini chocolate chips for the eyes. So I'm going to go ahead and see how this goes. And I'm, I didn't do these real fancy and pretty like because uh 
naked mole rats have lots of extra skin and folds, so it looked better just to do it this pattern. So I'm gonna put an eye up here. There we go, right here. Was her eyes close together? I can't remember. I think they're kind of close together. And I'm doing those pointed side down. There's your nose. <laughs> Sorry, it's just cracking me up. The fact that I'm sitting here making naked mole rat cupcakes. <laughs> you know you love your child when you're doing something like this. All right, so <laughs> there's one. Now I'm gonna see, they do have the bottom teeth, so I'm gonna go ahead and do some bottom teeth on this. And y'all, these almond slivers are the best. I mean, they, they look like teeth. All right, perfect. If that doesn't look like a naked mole rat, I don't know what does. All right, so let me get them all decorated and I'll take a final picture. Okay, so we absolutely, <laughs> I've been dying laughing at how these turned out. They look so cute. Everything worked out perfect. The only negative I have is that the Hershey's Kiss that we put inside the cupcakes did not uh, get as melted and gooey as I had hoped. And there were some reviews online that said that they wouldn't. So I just tried it because I've never tried it before. So that's the only thing about these cupcakes that didn't turn out exactly like I wanted. But y'all, look at this. If they don't look like a naked mole rat, I don't know what does. They are absolutely adorable. Bon appetit. Thank <laughs> you.